Hello, I want to introduce four easy stretches you can do to help relieve your neck pain. If you haven't seen me before, my name is Linda with Breath Body Connection where you get tips on how to feel great in your body and mind. For those of us that are behind the computer and our phones a lot, we end up creating really bad posture. I'm exaggerating here, but our shoulders start rolling in, our neck muscles get really tight and our head drops forward. We develop a little hump in the back and being like this is like holding a 10 pound ball in front of you all day long. That is really, really hard on the neck muscles, your back muscles and your shoulders. So with these four easy stretches, you get to open up and do counter poses to go the opposite way. The first thing I'd like to uh, introduce you to, to open your pecs, is I love these bands. They're called TheraBands. If you have one of these bands, I highly recommend you using them or buying them. But this exercise is called flossing, which I love. I do these almost every day. As you place your hands a little bit wider than your shoulders, you tug a little bit on the band and you go back and forth, back and forth. Maybe doing this five or six times. And then finally, you stop where it's the tightest. It's usually where your shoulder, elbow, and wrist line up together. Make sure you're not bending your elbows. If you need to, you can make loosen this up to straighten your elbows. And you stay here and take a deep breath, squeezing your shoulder blades towards each other, rolling your shoulder blades down your back. Stay for about five to 10 breaths, really opening along your pecs. So that's the first stretch. If you don't have a band, you can do the same thing by putting your hand against the wall and really, really stretching out your pecs. Once you've opened up your upper body, you can get on the floor, place your hands right under your shoulders, knees right under your hips, and we're gonna do some cat-cow, which is rolling your shoulders away from your spine, looking up, creating the biggest arch you can in your back, spreading your sit bones apart from each other, and then rounding as much as you can. Try to exaggerate these as much as possible. So you can do five or 10 cat cows to open up your back and then you're going to bring one hand up towards the sky and back down then the other last but not least we want to do a counter pose to bring your shoulders back and relax now i have two suggestions for you one if you have a bolster or really firm cushion, you could use that. And you could do this at home at night, you know, when you're watching TV or after a long day. You could put your bums against the bolster and just relax and put your shoulders back. 45 degrees and just stay here for five, 10 minutes. It's really good to do a counter pose after a long day. The other one is a little bit more intense, but it feels really good. You can take a block and put it on its side, and the other one on tall, and you can place the block about three or four inches below your neck, right in, in between your shoulder blades, and just lean back, and then bring the other block right under your head. This gives you a way deeper stretch. Open up your shoulders, relax your hands down, and stay here for five to 10 minutes. It feels really good. So now you have it, four stretches for your neck. Make it a mini routine. You could do them all in one day or spread it out throughout the week. I also have at my website, Breath Body Connection, 
some other neck and shoulder stretches. There are PDF files downloadable for free. So visit me there. Thank you and bye for now.